The following are the technical steps of a whole organ liver transplant. To begin the procedure, we need to remove the diseased native liver. To do so, we divide the blood supply and the bile duct. We first divide the right and left branch of the hepatic artery. The common hepatic and cystic ducts are divided. The portal vein is divided. A clamp is applied to the inferior vena cava, or IVC, below the liver. Another clamp is applied to the IVC above the liver. The hepatic veins are divided. The IVC is divided. The IVC is divided below the liver. The diseased liver is removed. In preparation for the vascularization of the to be transplanted liver, the openings of the hepatic veins and the vena cava are made into a common channel. This maximizes the outflow of the to be transplanted liver blood flow. We also create a common opening for the hepatic artery. A whole organ transplant is when the entire liver from a deceased donor is used for transplantation. We begin by connecting the top of the donor IVC to the patient's IVC. Then the IVC below the liver is connected to the patient's IVC. Next, the portal vein is connected, the clamps are removed, and blood flow in and out of the liver is restored. The hepatic artery is connected. Lastly, we connect the bile duct. It is common to be in the hospital for several weeks after the operation.